Lucy, Lucy, good girl. Winston, Winston, good boy. Um, Here's something to know about San Francisco. There are more dogs in this city than there are children. People really love their animals and they want the best for them. Well, they're part of the family. You know, I mean, they're the, they're the part of everyday uh, fabric of everyday life. That fabric, dog owners say, is about to be torn apart by newly proposed rules that would restrict where canines can romp here at the Golden Gate National Recreation Area. Dogs are allowed to run free across this beach at San Francisco's Chrissy Field, but the National Park Service says it's time to put the leash back on. As the numbers of dogs increased and the numbers of visit visitors overall increased, conflicts increased. Hey boys, all the way in. To reduce conflicts, the new rules call for seven off-leash sites, an expansion of leashed areas, and for dogs to be banned completely from this, the most popular stretch of beach here at Chrissy Field. Okay, come on, let's go. And that has dog advocates hot under the collar. When uh, the recreation area was uh, established in 1972, uh, it was very clear that they included dog walking in the recreation area. That's the framework in which we're working under. And it's something that the Park Service uh, culturally has been against for a long, long time. The Park Service says it isn't so. This is by far the most dog friendly uh, park of any in the national park system. And, and even among uh, state and county parks, um, this park is very welcoming of dogs. Too welcoming, according to some environmental groups, which have lobbied for tighter dog restrictions. A lot of people don't know, but when their dog chases a bird, that's a significant disturbance to the bird. The bird is really afraid for its life. And it isn't just birds. Other incidents, the Park Service says, have led to the proposed rules. We've had people bit by dogs, horses um, attacked by dogs. We've had people complain that their picnic's been disrupted uh, by dogs. The Park Service plans to issue a final ruling in early 2015, but first there's a public comment period. In a city where passions for dogs and environmentalism run equally hot, it's promising to be quite the struggle. And if the new rules do restrict dogs here, some owners, like Minden Kabara, are ready to practice some civil disobedience. Probably for a while at least, just be coming out getting tickets um, and kind of rebelling a little bit. So I wouldn't say test to enforce, I would say protest. <laughs> Dog conflicts are among the toughest to deal with, probably because of the passion of the constituency. Winston. Lucy, Eli, Eli, Eli.